Hey, what's going on? Of course, to all of my freaks and geeks out there, it is me, Quita, aka Belasian Quita, and I want to welcome you to Sin TV Now. So, for today's episode, I want to talk about why I decided to change the name of the show from Sin TV Gaming to Sin TV Now, and I also want to talk about the library is now open where I give you my opinions about your comments. So let's start off with that, shall we? And I'm going to be doing this get ready with me, as they call it. I'm just getting ready, of course. So library's now open. Let's get into it. Now, I have been getting some comments with some of you who have been saying that I am annoying and that I am boring and, and all of that. So what I have to say is this. The first thing I like to do, of course, is use the simple Sensitive Skin Experts, and this is a Replenishing Rich Moisturizer Lotion. Very good, and it's very important to moisturize your face, especially if you are going outside. Also, if you can get a lotion with some good like sunscreen in there, that's important as well. Now, as a disclaimer, like I always say, make sure that you check with a medical professional before putting anything on your face and body because what works for me may not work for you. So, but I digress. So with that, I mean, I find it interesting that some of you find me annoying and boring. So this is what I decided to do. I am no longer, and I mean, I am done. I am no longer going to be talking about myself. It is a waste of my time. And to some of you, it's just not worth my time. Just, I I'm not going to be dealing with it. So I'm done talking about myself. I'm only going to be focusing on the following. So Sin TV Now is going to be about the following. We're going to be talking about smart, intelligent news. And we're going to be taking it from the multicultural perspective because I feel that is a, pers a perspective that is not always taken seriously. And I want to give different perspectives to the multicultural perspective. So that's the first thing I'm going to be talking about. The second thing... And I always like to make sure to kind of move my face a little bit here with the lotion to make sure that it gets a really even application. And that's also important when you're putting makeup on. Just saying. Um, skin care is very important to good skin. So I digress. But the second thing that I'm going to be talking about besides the smart, intelligent news is, of course, I still will be playing games. Many of you, and I have to make sure, I have to make sure, I got to give a very special shout out to a really intellectual gentleman. His name is Chris. He loves the um, MMO games that you can play with controller support series. I will continue to do that. Most of the games that I'll be playing, you can use a controller and they'll, they'll not even also be, it'll, it'll be beyond uh, MMOs as well, because of course I'm going to be starting to play Mass Effect or what I like to call it interracial Mass Effect. And because Chris has been such a gentleman, you know, complimenting this show and really taking the time um, to understand the show. And I really Chris, thank you so much. You have my utmost respect. And because of that, I'm going to be naming my character in Mass Effect will be called Chris Shepard. So, <laughs> so definitely because of you and, and so many of you, but, but thank you so much, Chris, for really um, respecting me and appreciating um, this show. It means so much to me that that Chris and so many of you enjoy what I do and you have my utmost respect. So thank you. And Chris also gave a lot of really good suggestions of games that I should play. And and definitely I will be playing all of them. And, and I'm sure many of you will enjoy that as well. So thank you once again, Chris. Um, for for just being such a good person and and a just a proper gentleman. Thank you so much. And then of course I will be focusing on interviews because so many of you freaks, so many of you geeks love the interviews that I do. So I will be doing those as well. 
And then, of course, I'm going to be focusing on the Asian pop culture. I love Asian pop culture. It's always been interesting to me. Hey, so definitely to the good-looking Asian men out there, to the intellectual Asian men out there, thank you for doing what you do. You have my utmost respect and appreciation. So I will be talking about that. So let's go over this one more time so everybody is aware of what Sin TV Now is going to be about. It's going to be about smart, intelligent news. It's going to be about music. So I do another show, of course. So if you like rock and metal and alternative culture, then you will love the Curvy Metal Head Show. So that's going to be all rock and metal and alternative culture stuff. But then this show is going to be all the other stuff. So we will be getting into how I feel about Beyonce, how I feel about Nicki Minaj and all of that. So I'll be talking about other genres of music that are outside of rock and metal. So we'll be getting into that as well. The Asian pop culture, like I mentioned earlier, and and just giving that multicultural perspective. Plus, we'll also be talking about what I like to call interracial pop culture, because this is something I don't see a lot of people talking about. So I'll be doing things like movie reviews on movies such as like Romeo Must Die, like movies that have an interracial... Um, relationship in it and just giving perspective because I think the multicultural perspective is greatly overlooked and always it's always stereotyped and never taken seriously and given proper respect so I that's what I really want to do with the show so that's what that's going to be about and then I'm using the simple sensitive skin experts revitalizing I roll on and this is just you know I haven't really been sleeping a lot so I um I use this because it just helps to make my eyes look more awake. And it's really, it's very, very important to take care of the skin on your eye. It's very, very soft and, and very, you want to make sure to get it as tight as you possibly can. So, and I, I usually take the leftover amount of the product and put it over my brows. And, and then that's pretty much it then for my brows here. This is how I started off. This is just the e.l.f. Uh, brow pencil. And this is in the shade Natural Brown. So I just take a little bit of this. And I just go in. And as you can see, it really does a good job of filling in my... The places where I don't have hair, which is... My brows are always something I'm always working on, just like with my mascara for my lashes. So then I just take a little bit more of that, and I always look into a mirror just to make sure that I am applying my brows on correctly. Because the worst thing you can do is have horrible brows, and yeah, I, I know how it's like to have horrible brows it is just never good so then I just usually just this is like my everyday that I do and then I usually just brush that out and that's pretty much it for my brows and then what I also would do sometimes is I'll go in with like um some powder or or whatnot and then I'll go in with some concealer too so for my concealer I'm using the e.l.f. concealer. This is the new concealer they just came out with in deep. And this is really... My only problem with this concealer, though, I will say, is it is very oily. So I have to use a lot of translucent um, face powder when I'm using it. But it works really, really nicely, though. And then I use my brush here. This is the Givenchy Eye Round Brush. And this is what's giving me this really K-pop, very soft eye look. And then I just kind of go over it and blend it out. So that's just my everyday natural. But of course, like I always like to do, I like to leave you with some food for thought, which is just me uh, concluding today's episode. And what I want to say is this. Some of you say that I'm annoying and boring, but here's the thing. If you don't like someone, there this is just this is just me, okay? Take the time to do things that you enjoy versus doing things that you don't enjoy. So if you don't enjoy what I do, don't 
don't watch the show. You're wasting your time. You could be watching shows that you actually enjoy. And like I said from the beginning, I've just decided that I'm not going to talk. I am no longer going to talk about myself anymore because it's just a waste of my time and it's just unnecessary. Because from what I see, so many of you um, don't really care about me talking about myself. So I'm not going to talk about myself because it's a waste of my time. And I'd rather do things that I actually enjoy than to kind of stress myself out. I'm not stressing myself out anymore with this show. So with that, like I always say, remember to get smart and, of course, stay informed.